what's up y'all i'm still chilling here it took that that video like almost an hour to upload because i'm not at home and i have no wi-fi blah 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 you know yada yada you know um but uh, okay what i want for this channel and for my life is like I said to help people I want to be able to eventually once I finally hit a thousand subscribers if I can you know if you know God willing and you guys continue to like share and follow me obviously <laughs> Um, once I finally do hit a thousand people, I can finally go live. I know technically I can go live right now, but, uh, you know, on my laptop and stuff, but I am never on my laptop. I am not somebody that likes to sit I have to be mobile, so technically, you know, mobile, phone, you know, walking around, something that a lot of people don't know how to do anymore, um, at least without a phone in their face, obviously, um, now, um, how, how do I want to help people, like, I, want to once I go live I want to be able ha to have a live as you know obviously the paranormal stuff I love learning about paranormal stuff but that'll be second to I want one day to be a live stream and people talking about like say nothing but you know relationship problems or one day be health problems one day being this is a touchy subject suicide depression that's what I want I want to be able to reach out to a certain group of people each and every day and I want to be able to obviously go back and talk about that stuff again and again and again and oh Rob Zombie feels so numb I love this channel man I haven't changed the station yet I love this channel but that is what I want to do with this because I know there, that that is something that a lot of people don't know, you know, don't do is help people. Another thing that I want to do is, like I said, I want to travel the world. That's something that I've always wanted to do, and I'm hoping that eventually, eventually, this will lead to that. But with that being said, I want to be able to. I want to be able to have the money and the resources also. But whenever I say money and resources, I don't mean for me. Listen, I grew up poor. I, like, I grew up dirt fucking poor. Like, bro, I can make I can make $10 last for like two weeks if I have to. Trust me, I've done it before. I want to be able to have the money for, yes, not only me and my, my family to live off of, but I want to be able to also go out and help the people that are less fortunate than I am. You know, I want to be able to, you know, if, if I see, you know, somebody on the side of the road that that needs you know that's standing out there for you know what it's signs saying we'll work for food 
Like, if you have a family to feed, like, I want to be able to do that. I want to be able to feed your family. I want to be able to buy you a house, buy you a car. You know, I want to be able to do that just because it's what's right to do. You know, that is that is what I want to be able to do. Now, obviously, obviously, I need help to do that. <laughs> you know, so like, uh, you know, I want to be able to not only like, I guess, build my own brand quote unquote I don't I don't fucking know but like I just I just want to be able to help people out like I love to help people out that is that is what I've always been always been good at is helping people out whether it's you know just talking or physically going over and cutting somebody's grass or you know helping somebody build a shed my grandfather all the fucking time I, I helped them build three fucking shit. No, four sheds. But, you know, that that's family. I want to be able to help people that's not family. I want to be able to help people that's in a different town, a different state, a different fucking country. You know, like, obviously, like, the language barrier. <laughs> that wouldn't be fantastic because all I know is English. I, I, I know like three words in Spanish and like three words in French that's the extent of it <laughs> so like I but it, it doesn't matter like I still want to be able to help people you know I want to like I said I want to be able to like eventually I want to be able to have like, almost like a chat room type deal, you know, where, you know, we can go and just, you know, a group of people just talk about a certain subject for a day. And, you know, I want to, you know, I, I've played football my entire life. I've done... I guess mixed martial arts isn't really a, a team type thing. I mean, it is technically, but it's not, I guess, since you're essentially in the, in the octagon by yourself fighting. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, I want to be able to build a team of people to, to do the same thing, that want to have or have the same the same feelings and, you know, have the same wants that I do, you know, that's, that's what I'm hoping to accomplish with, with this, like, I want it to be so, so much that, like, I can literally give people my cell phone number and people can fucking text me, hey, I'm having a bad day, Hey, I, 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 I really need your help. Hey, I'm thinking about blowing my head off. Like, that's what I want to be able to help with. Like, trust me, I've been there. I've, I've been so down, you know, that, that I... didn't think that I had anybody. You know, I... Growing up knowing that I was adopted... That, that took a toll on me. It, not only that, but I, I've had multiple, multiple concussions from a, a various bunch of accidents. But, you know, everything kind of stems to, you know, everything that leads to, like, the depression type bill. You know, I want to be able to help with that. Again, I grew up. 
battling depression and anxiety. I still am battling depression and anxiety. I'm now on medicine for anxiety because it started to, it, 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 it actually finally got to me and damn near killed me. It, it almost killed me twice. You know, this is a good song too. I haven't heard this song and I could not tell you how long. Deftone changes. Cha well, change. This is a fucking weird ass video. <laughs> but like I like I said, like I wouldn't be able to get to the point where you know people are able to fucking text me. Like I will give you my number. You, if you're having a bad day, if I can stop you from doing something stupid to yourself or your family or anything like that, like please, like let me fucking help. I'm begging you, let me help. I've been watching this show called American Monster on Discovery Plus, and it is, hold on, I got some guy coming up to me, okay, but yeah, I've been watching Discovery Plus, and it, 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 it a show called uh, American Monster, and it's not like, you know, like crypto people, you know, crypto creatures, it's, it's literally fucking human beings that are lead up to, you know, a, a bunch of different situations that lead up to them murdering their families or going out and becoming an active shooter. You know, I carry a gun on me at all times. I, yes, I have depression. Yes, I have anxiety. But do I want to hurt anybody? No, I don't. You know, I, I've had so many times where I'm so, like, I was so pissed off that I just, like, I wanted to rip somebody's head off. But I kept it to myself and I walked away. I didn't take it out on anybody. You know, yeah, I've, I've argued with people. Did I want to hurt somebody? No. No. You know, like, and uh, I, again, you know, I... I attempted suicide quite a few times. I'm still here for a reason. If I can make helping people, if I can, if I can travel the world just to help people out. Obviously, you know, yes, make money off of it. But if I can travel the world to help people out, you know, I mean, obviously I have to make money to travel the world. But if I can, like, I, it's hard to, see, it's hard to talk about that after you say, okay, money has to be involved. Because I don't want to do it for the money. Again, yes, you need the money in order to be able to do it, to be, to be able to do what I want to do. But it's more of I want to see people to I want to see I want to be able to see a family that is struggling about to lose our house you know get hit with a fucking miracle and you know I want I you know eventually you know I want that miracle to be me you know, I, I'm not trying to say I want to be, you know, a god or anything. Like, I just want to help. That's all. That is all I want. And, you know, again, like, I know I'm babbling on about it. I know I keep saying it because it is just something that it's something that means a lot to me because... I've been through so much in my life and I'm still I'm I'm going through it as we speak with the health issues and everything else going on like 
this last, the, you know, this this last year has been down far the hardest year of my life because I was I was scared you know every day I, I'd wake up in the morning if if I if I did sleep you know I'd wake up you know and I'd be shocked that I didn't die in my sleep that that's how bad this year was you know like like I Technically, the last time I went to the hospital, I finally told Ashley this last night. The last time I went to the hospital, I flatlined three times. Twice in the ambulance and once in the emergency room. The last time I was gone for seven minutes, a little over seven minutes. The nurse quite literally told me this. She told me it took them five minutes just to get to the room because they were tending with somebody else and they were short-staffed. I almost died. Well, I did die, technically. But I was almost gone for good. All because of asthma and anxiety. So, I wouldn't be able to... You know, if, if I can sit there, well, it's asthma, anxiety, and allergies. Technically, it's more allergies, but I was having panic attacks on top of the asthma attacks. Almost a wreck, bro. There was almost a wreck. <laughs> Dumbass people up in Greensboro can't fucking drive. But, like... Yeah, I want to be able to, you know, if I can calm you down from hurting yourself or hurting your family, you know, or ultimately trying to take your lives or their lives, or, you know, if I can, if I can buy you those groceries that you need for the week or the month if I can you know buy you the car that you need to get to work or buy you the house to you know house your families that is what I want to be able to do so I also want to have fun doing it so, um, and this is fun to me. Like, I, sitting here making videos, it's fun to me. Like, I've, I've never been a people person. I've always been a shy, keep to myself, you know, nobody, pretty much. I, you know... In high school, I taught, you know, I told you about the girl that I dated. I, I should not have been with her. Not because of, you know, like an age difference or anything like that. Like, dude, I was, yeah, I, I played football. But I hung out with, like, the geeky kids. And, you know, like, like I told my fiance the other day, I hung out with, like, the people that would pick their nose and eat their boogers. And, you know, like, goofy shit like that. And I was dating the lead cheerleader in the, in the high school. You know, like, the prettiest girl in the school, pretty much. And, you know, it, 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 practically the prettiest girl in the fucking, in the entire town. You know, that, that's how... my relationship stuff started and the fact that I and like I didn't think we were going to be anything because I grew up not not knowing my real dad I grew up you know thinking people didn't want me 
and I, at first, whenever we, you know, it, like, I, it, it's, it's, I don't want to talk about it, I don't want to get into it, because, you know, it'll bring back memories, and it'll make me tear up, and I don't, I ain't down with that, but, it's, I, I grew up, like I said, with the feeling that people didn't want me, you know, like, I wasn't supposed to be here. And that, I can't lie, it's still going on. You know, it, I, I have that, that thought every day. But, if I can, you know, I know now that there is a reason why I'm still here. And I think this might be it. You know, I'm obviously not like a preacher or pastor or anything like that but i love absolutely love to help people out you know i mean if i can help you know if i can do good in the world just just by this that would be awesome you know if i can like i said if i can change the world just a little bit, just a little bit. If I can make it a little bit of a better play, a better place, that would be awesome. That would be, I would be able to die happy knowing that I accomplished something. I, you know, I made people's lives better you know i made i kept somebody from taking their own life i it, i had somebody walk in on me with a gun in my mouth and This person literally, literally kicked the gun out of my hand before I pulled the trigger. Like, <clears throat> like she walked in and without even thinking, like, first reaction was to fucking, you know, just, just kick the fucking, kick my hand and, you know, kick the gun away from me. And... That was, obviously, that was the first time I tried. I tried it a couple couple other times. Well, I tried, that was the first time I tried. Yeah, talk about a big first time. And the second time, I pulled the trigger. I pulled it. I still have the shell to prove that it just completely, it was like something stopped everything and it just crunched the shell down it was it it was it's weird as hell like i nobody can explain it i took the shell to people that are profession you know a professional fucking uh, ammo maker and he looked at me and was like i have no idea what happened i have no idea how this happened this shouldn't have happened so obviously that that was the first there that was the second time i I tried to shoot myself. That wasn't the second time I tried committing suicide. I tried over. I, I, I overdosed a couple times. I, you know, I, I, uh, you know, yeah, I got scars. And, you know, uh, shit like that. Like, like, it, yeah, it, I know how it is. And exactly what I'm doing right now, I want to be able to fucking sit there and talk to people, you know, start, I, I'll tell my story, and then you can tell your stories, you know, sit back and forth and just tell stories, kind of like an AA meeting, oh, Jesus, I just hit myself in the nuts, oh, <laughs> 
But kind of, yeah, like, kind of like, you know, like AA meetings, you know, NA meetings, shit like that, you know, that's kind of what it would be like, but it would just be us back and forth talking, you know, and then, you know, if, if we can make it to where we can go and like I said, go into like a chat room type deal or like go into like a Skype or a Zoom thing and all of us get on fucking camera and talk about shit like that would be that it would that is what I want right there to have you know a shit ton of people all on camera all in one room talking about the same damn thing and everybody but one person is quiet everybody gets a chance to talk everybody gets a chance to tell their stories or try to help somebody else that's what I want that would be cool as hell so I guess in conclusion with this long ass fucking video that wasn't supposed to be this long um, if there is anybody out there that has the same feelings that I do that wants the same thing that I uh, that I want you know and it's not that's not the only thing I want to do uh, in my life obviously yes I want to help people <clears throat> I want to help myself I want to have fun doing it I want to make a shit ton of fucking money and and you know while I'm living this life and I want to have the, my the best life that I can live I want and I want to try to make I want to you know I want to try to help people to have the best life that they have and that they can live you know it's not about being millionaires you know it's about being happy you know money money event you know essentially is the root of all evil but you can't do anything without it unfortunately it sucks <clears throat> but again if there's anybody out there that has the same feelings the same motivations that I do dude please get a hold of me whoever it is please get a hold of me like we can we can fucking you know uh, I, I'm not a big computer guy I'm not I'm terrible on computers but we can get together and try to try to build something like you know let me know please like my email is is in the the thing like in my about me but it's it's stumpy joe 3134 at gmail.com you know s t u m p y j o e 3134 at gmail.com i have the same one as a yahoo but i don't get on there anymore i can i just choose not to um you know and my facebook's on there my Twitter's on there. Like, get a hold of me. Like, dude, we can we can build something, please. Cause I just want to make this fucked up world a little bit better place while I'm still here. And I ain't got much longer to live. You know, I, even if I live till I'm, even if I live till I'm a hundred. You know, I'm thirty one. My life is a quarter, essentially a quarter, a little over a quarter of the way over already. I don't have much more to give. You know, I have, I have a very, very shallow, dark sense of humor and a very shallow, dark heart. I've been, it's been broken many, many times. So, the little bit of good that I have left in me, I want to be able to spread it. It, it. it might be small, it may only be a little bit. 
you know, it, or it, it may be only a little bit, but I have, like, a, it's weird. Like, I have a little bit of good. I hate everything, but I have a little bit of good left in me. But it's a lot of good. You know, I want to make the world, the whole world, a better place. You know, and I want, I want people who want the same thing as my teammates. Like, let's do this thing for real. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Again, if you need anything, my email's in here. My Facebook, my Twitter, everything. I just fucking built my Instagram yesterday. Well, I just, I started it kind of. Kind of. So, like, yeah. Hit me up. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later.